Hey, what's going on, everybody? Welcome to another unboxing here at Social Rec. I'm very stoked out about these ACG shoes, right? They went on sale, what, you know, they went on sale a few months ago, and I was hesitant to pull the trigger on it, but then when I decided that I wanted them, they weren't available anymore. And so they recently went back into stock. And it's the ACG Air Deschutes sandal. Now, people might make fun of them, call them whatever they want. Um, but I was really excited to get these because, hey, you warm around outside, warm around in different climates, different settings, whatever. All conditions, gear, designed, tested, and made on planet Earth for outdoor use. I like to run around outside with my kids a lot. I like to try to go for a jog or just do some stuff. And so I'm, I, I was pretty stoked to to purchase these. Now, the colorway I wanted, um, there was a few colorways that have come out. The all black, the um, like white bone kind of color. But the color I was looking for was the multi color. And so, voila. Now, of course, these ain't nothing to to go crazy over you're not going to see these dropping on the sneakers app and people are just kind of gobbling them up but you know they are fairly comfy i do like the midsole it gives it like an old timey feel it really reminds me of of dirk nowitzki with the deschutes um german phrase but i do like this react midsole uh, it's durable it's it's like non-slip proof it's really comfy um I was able to try it on earlier today and I just overall the the color scheme of it really works now as far as fitting goes on these um, you have to do the Nike my fit to figure out because they don't come in half sizes they only come in in full sizes so you really need to figure out are you if you're in between sizes I probably go up um, unless you have more shoes that are leaning towards the smaller size like if you're a nine and a half I would probably go down to a nine if you mostly wear tens and I would stick with the ten um, sizing guides have changed lately so I'm um, just kind of figure out what size you wear now I was thankful because once I had bought these I was like uh, should I go down to a nine should I stick with the ten what should I do and I'm pretty content with the ten but even even if I wanted to I probably couldn't because there's no more sizes available and so that's one it's the one shoe one sandal and then of course the other one so you know whether you're a fan of, of sandals or not do these really count as kicks probably not but I think overall there's a big community of sandal wearers out there I'm pretty excited to give these a test run so yeah that's them the Nike Air Deschutes and you know as part of this video I wanted to do another unboxing video as well So yes, you do get two for the price of one. And so uh, right before I had purchased these Air Deschutes, I had saw these on the Nike app and they really just caught my eye. Now, people aren't big fans of the mids and the mids get a lot of heat and hate and you know laughed at for people that wear mids but you know if you were if you were me in high school you know early 2000s mid 2000s mids were pretty hot right you had the black and gold that sierra rocked in her video you had the jordan opening days that were mids that i have a pair of that i you know don't even i didn't even know they were mids until mids became a, a thing this past year so these are the jordan mid one, uh, Jordan 1 Mid SE and they are the brush stroke edition again they really caught my eye um, I do love this packaging with the gold Jordan emblem there on the cover and then you have this tissue with the reflective gold 23 there but here they are and let me know what you what you think so of course there's a reason why they're called brush stroke if you look right at them Boom, right? That check is not your regular stitch check, it is a brush stroke check. You have the splatter paint on top of canvas material, it's very soft, and then you have the splatter paint on the midsole as well. And this, of course, is based off of 
artists, you know, that do a bunch of paintings, do a bunch of artist work. Um, this was their inspiration for creating this shoe. Now you do have the canvas suede feel on the check over here and you see where it splits. You have the brush stroke on that side and you have the stitching here on this side. So the collar is always lined fairly well, very soft, very cushioned. Um, these aren't, you know, there's, there isn't any leather on this. It's all just straight canvas. Oops, let me get that. There's your front look on it with the Jordan Air Air Jordan logo. But yeah, I mean, I think I really like them because they stand out. Um, they can go with pretty much anything that you want to rock. You can swap out your laces for uh, your white laces for the black laces. And then, you know, everybody has their different style of, of what they like and what they don't like. And, you know, again, these just really stood out to me for their their inspirational story of you know I, I could see an artist rocking these or even if an artist is using you know a dunk or a, a Jordan 1 right their shoe it gets all covered with paint and so this really has that aesthetic and an inspiration and love behind it so I'm really digging these joints really want to you know put them on feet hopefully wear them fairly soon and just hopefully turn some heads but yeah I really digging these Air Jordan mid one SE brush strokes um, let me know what y'all think in the comments and yeah you got we got a two for one unboxing make sure you check out the other social red content podcasts coming soon uh, all right y'all take care